next guests are little business women in the making. As crafting influencers known for their adorable YouTube videos, they have quite the entrepreneurial spirit, all while inspiring kids to get creative. And all their crafts can be made with the things that you have already in your home. So here to show us a fun kid-approved project, please welcome Kids Crafts by Three Sisters, Grace, Riley, and Reese. Hi, Kelly! Oh, I like your sign, ladies, with the sunflowers. That's nice. <laughs> well, ladies, you guys are always coming up with new ideas, right? Yes. We normally come up with most of our craft ideas, and then we test them the night before to make sure that they work. And we like to be more innovative so people will like to watch our videos. Right on. Well, what are we making today? Kinetic sand. All right. So for those of us who, I mean, I totally know, but for others that don't, what's kinetic sand? Kinetic sand is sand slash slime that you can mold into any shape or form, almost like Play-Doh. You can make any sort of shapes with it, and you can also stretch it to make it different consistencies. We like to use our kinetic sand to make mini beaches for our toys, and it's super fun to play with. Awesome. All right, all right. So we have everything I need in front of me, so where do we start? So your first step is you're going to take one cup of sand and then one tablespoon of cornstarch and mix those in a bowl together. And okay. we already have our mix, so you're going to want to mix yours. Okay. And then you're going to take one pinch of slime, and then you're going to start kneading it into your sand. Okay. And it does help if you stretch it out so the sand will mix better together with the slime. Okay. The next step is to take your water and soap mixture and just add a little bit into your bowl. The key is to not add too much or else your mixture will turn into wet sand. <laughs> I feel like I have like way more sand than like this stuff. But this is yeah. so fun. Oh, it looks really good. It's becoming more stringy, so that's good. How did y'all start crafting? Did you know, did you start loving to do it or did your mom do it or? We always loved crafting and making things for our little toys called Lilith's Pet Shops. And we make little houses for them or furniture. And we really loved pretending to make YouTube videos with no cameras. And we really wanted to start a YouTube channel. So our mom suggested that instead of showing kids how to buy and consume things, we should show them how to make things with their creative mind with using things around the house. That's so cool. And mine, you know, you guys aren't here, but if you were here, it looks perfect. <laughs> Yeah, so when you're, when it feels like it's not really that stretchy, you can add baby oil because it will become that kin kinetic sand texture and make it more stringy and stick together. Okay, I'm going to just add baby oil. I'm going to do it. How much baby <laughs> oil? I didn't ask before I did it. It doesn't really matter. It's just really like science. It's all about getting the right consistency and feeling around. And oh, yours this feels cool. Yeah, yours could probably use a little more dish soap and water. Oh, okay. Yeah, wait, are you judging mine? Is that what's happening? Is that... <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally kidding. I'm totally kidding. Um, so when do we add the color? <laughs> so once you have kinetic sand texture, after you've added your dish soap and your baby oil, yeah. then it starts to become, it all starts to meet together. That's when you can add your paint. And I'm doing blue, I'm doing pink, and okay. I'm doing orange. And Kelly, we heard your favorite color is purple, so you're doing purple. So here we go. I'm gonna do this. Wait, I'm gonna use these just in case it stains. I, you know, I still have work to do after this. So I'm gonna. You know what we're gonna do? Yeah. So usually you would do this, right? You'd get it all in there. But look, TV magic, ladies. Um, we have some right here. So look, my staff did. Look how cute. They, oh shoot. Wait, I, I was gonna. Wait, let me do this one. Look how cute that is. That's really cute. It's a purple heart. So how do you keep it from drying out? So you can put it in a Tupperware plastic container, or you can put it in a Ziploc baggie. And after about two weeks, your kinetic sand will dry out, but then it's time to make more. This is like so, see, my kids got me into slime. It's like therapeutic. This does feel cool. Thank you so much, ladies. First of all, your craft room is on point. It looks so rad. Um, and every. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. Check out Kids Crafts by Three Sisters on their YouTube channel. You don't want to miss it. Yep, I'm still here. Just waiting for you to subscribe. If you don't, I'll be trapped in this box forever.